Hey, how's it going? It's another Monday, another Blast Off Mondays episode. We are shooting my one of my old racing helmets again. This time we are going to be shooting it from 10 yards with my uh, shotgun here, my trusty distant arm shotgun. And we are going to be shooting birdshot. And the two questions we posed to you last week was, we're going to shoot this from the side. But actually this time we decided we're going to shoot it from the back. Okay, so it's clear. So there's no bullet holes or anything like that. We're going to shoot it from the back. And the question was, are any of those BBs from the birdshot going to penetrate through to the back? Then the next question is, we're going to turn it and shoot the visor from the front, basically the front of the helmet. And now we want to know, are any of the BBs going to penetrate the visor since this is supposed to be a racing helmet and it should take some impact. So we're going to see what happens. But before we start that, I want to announce the winner of last week. So our winner from last week, right down here, email us at info at tacklehive.com. We'll coordinate with you to get some swag out. All right, so let's get set up. I'm going to move down to 10 yards and we're going to shoot this two different ways. Before we shoot the second way, we'll take a look at what happened and then we'll shoot the front of the helmet. So here we are at 10 yards. Helmet, the rear of the helmet is right there on the rack. Let's see what happens. All right, I see a lot of marks, but uh, let's see if anything penetrated through. So as you can see from the outside, looks like there was a lot of damage. That bird shot really spread across, but when upon closer look, really they're just dense. It's marking off the, the paint, um, some cracks here and there, but definitely nothing went through at all. Looking on the inside, it's absolutely pristine. There's no BBs in here. You've tried to feel on the outside, there's nothing. So. For those of you who answered that the birdshot wouldn't penetrate the back of the helmet or the side of the helmet, really, you're entered into a random drawing for some free swag and we'll announce the winner next week. But now what we're gonna do is we're gonna flip the helmet and we're gonna shoot the front. We're, we know it's not gonna get through here, but we are considering whether it will go through the visor here. That's what we want to find out. So. Personally, I don't think it's going to go through, but that's based on ratings of these racing helmets. I don't know. I'll be really surprised if it goes through. I'll be shocked. I've never crashed, so I don't know, but uh, this should stop it. So we'll see. All right, so we're back here at the 10. The helmet has been turned over. Let's see if this bird shot will penetrate through the visor. All right, I don't know, we'll take a look. There you have it, it looks really bad. If you watch the video, the visor did go up a little bit just from the force of the, the power of the bird shot. But when you look at this visor, it looks like things went through, but there's absolutely no penetration. This uh, visor on the inside, no, there's no holes, nothing went through. All the damage is just on the outside. So a race car helmet will, <laughs> save you from bird shot, whether you're wearing it, no matter where you get shot. Uh, was really curious about the visor. Again, if the ratings are true, it shouldn't have penetrated and it didn't. So I'm, I'm glad I used the helmet that actually had a valid rating. So if you guessed or left a comment that said that it wouldn't penetrate the visor, you too are also entered into a random drawing for some free swag and we'll announce both winners next week. 